Color in my room, you know, my two favorite passions, outdoors and sports. It's a place where I can just beat me. Nobody else can judge what I do or anything. And it's just a great place to be. The first day I was at Robbie's house, it was very evident that Robbie's bedroom was his universe. Ready? I was diagnosed at the age of five with Duchenne muscular dystrophy, which is it's the way at my muscle cells. The dystrophin protein is not made in the muscle, so the muscle tends to waste away. At age 80, he started to slow down. 12, he was in a wheelchair. At 19, he's got very limited use of hands. But you know, he's got the same thought process every other 19-year-old boy has. Cars, girls, video games. My mom is like my main advocate. She's just there for me, helps me do basically every function I need to do. Want a drink? And almost everything was hard to do without calling for assistance. Before Bill came along, Bill's our tech genius. I met Bill through the Muscular Dystrophy Association. He asked if we needed anything, and I said, well, if you happen to know anybody that knows anything about voice activation, it'd be phenomenal. Hey, Google, turn on feet. OK, turning on the feet. A couple days later, I had a phone call. Carrie mentioned right off that Robbie's bed is something he can no longer control. He would have to holler to Carrie to make a small incremental change in the bed so he was no longer sore. I was up every hour, hour and a half. I was getting no sleep. Robbie was getting no sleep. And so that I saw how coming up with a solution for Robbie's bed would have an impact on both of them. He had to do a lot of research to figure out how to make this work. Hey, Google, turn on head. You got it, turning on the head. And from there, little by little, we kept adding and adding and adding. Hey, Google, turn on TV. Turning on TV. It was kind of, what does my imagination allow me to want to have voice activated? Hey, Google, turn on row one. Hey, Google, turn on fan. Hey, Google, call Carrie. Calling Carrie Ivy. Yes, Roberto. I'm able to do stuff on my own, and it lets me give my mom a break a little bit. I expected not to get any sleep for the rest of my life. And here, you know, I can get out and take a walk. Sometimes I need that hour, hour and a half of sanity to get away from, hey Google, hey Google, hey Google. Oh, so these, he has no choice. I bought them for him. <laughs> so is that all the shirts I'm taking? Voice activation, it opened up a whole new world that I don't think many people really can understand yet. Robbie's got a lot more freedom than he had before. Most people think that just because you're in a chair, everything's disabled. But the, my main attribute's my mind. I've always had the hopes that he would go to college. He's an honor student. He's incredibly smart. He applied for four or five colleges and has acceptance letters from everyone he applied to. After 19 years, it's kind of about time. You start going off on your own, doing your own thing. Robbie's bedroom back home helped Robbie gain independence. We've tried to replicate that same environment here at the dorm. Hey Google, turn on the head. You got it, turning on the head. He's in an environment that's all new. And I think to know that he hasn't lost all of that capability that he gained will be comforting to him. But beyond that, he'll be challenged in ways that he hasn't anticipated yet. He has a drive, he wants to succeed. He wants to be something. And as long as he pushes, that's what he's going to get. Bye. I'm excited for this new chapter. And I feel like everything's in front of me.